Ooh, color me excited, a Wacky Races racing game. This should be good, right? I'm slightly suspicious that this only came out in Japan, but it was made by Atlas, so at least that's promising. I absolutely loved this cartoon as a kid, but it's been a long time since I've seen it, so I'm really hoping that this game doesn't tarnish my nostalgia of it. At first glance, this is promising, as there are the traditional 10 races to choose from. The Japanese translations of the names are on point as usual. Penelope Pitstop is called Fussy Cat, the Ant Hill Mob are named Gang 7, and Peter Perfect is delightfully just called Handsome 9. You can't play as Dick Dastardly, but as I remember, he was never actually an official participant in any of the races. He just sort of turned up and tried to screw with everybody. That's pretty much what he does here, too. There's no need to qualify for any of these races. You simply press A to stop Muttley's rotating sign, which decides what position the you start at, then it's straight into the race. So to the starting grid, I'm the Slag Brothers because they crack me up. Let's go! Uh, wait, what? Something must be wrong here, I'm pressing A, B, I'm not moving. I see the Bouldermobile in some cutscene, Red Max drives by in his car plane thing and I'm getting smashed up. It was a cool animation, but I feel pretty cheated right now. Okay, back to it. I still can't move? Well, what am I doing wrong? It's not start. The up direction shifts my car a little to the right. Still no forward momentum, though. Oh, great. Lazy Luke and his stupid bear friend are now chopping at my car with axes. Okay, so I just can't move at all? Oh, I think I see. I pressed left because I'm trying to head left on the screen. It's almost as if this game isn't actually a racing game. You're literally just moving with the arrow keys, and it's a very stop-start process that looks as if you're moving grid-like around a snakes and ladders board. There are arrows pointing in various seemingly random directions, and nobody seems to follow them. They just go wherever they please, Carmageddon style. I think you're looking for an exit or a finish line, but there's no real indication where this is. All the vehicles seem to travel at exactly the same speed all the time, meaning there's no way to actually catch up to any of your competitors, never mind overtake them. You can see something that I'm guessing is a map with the rough locations of the other cars. However, they're not actually shown on a map of the track as such. They're just pixels floating in a black void. Is there even a track anyway? Apart from the starting grid, position doesn't even seem to matter as it's not tracked anywhere, and there are no lap counters or anything like that to speak of. In fact, it's as if you're racing point to point in the countryside, which, come to think of it, rings a bell with the cartoon, as they weren't usually on racetracks, if I remember correctly. I'm not sure how I managed it after taking a while to even move, then getting annihilated every 10 seconds by one of my opponents, but somehow I actually finished 6th in the first race. How this happened, I have no clue, because I don't think I overtook or damaged anyone. How absolutely bizarre this title is. I mean, it looks cool in that it's very recognisable as Wacky Races. All of the characters are faithful to the cartoon. I was really hopeful when I saw the character select screen, it was a very bright start. However, I have never before seen a game that falls apart so quickly and completely as soon as the actual gameplay starts. I was left completely dumbfounded and a little bit down about the fact that this is actually the only Wacky Races game we will get until 2000 on the Game Boy Color. Now that game is something to behold, but we'll have to wait until the sequel to this book to look at it. Sometimes I'm confused as to why a game never made it out of Japan. In this case, there is absolutely no confusion on my part. Well, that is until the game starts, at which point I have absolutely no idea what's going on. 